like this, let's just go and test the endpoints and see what we have. So if we have f of negative 1, because again, the graph is we know is continuous. 4 minus 3 times negative 1, that becomes a positive. That's positive 3. That equals 7. And f of 2 is 4 minus 3 times 2. That becomes 6, which is equal to negative 2. Right? So now, hey, we, got, we know that there's a maximum. We know there's a line. We know nothing else funny is going on. We know it's continuous. So we can say f has a minimum, let's just say min, um, of f of 2 equal to negative 2 at x equals 2. And f has a max of f of negative 1 equals 7 at x equals negative 1. Now, do you, I want you guys to just stop for 